Well, I think the most important way in which Stephen Harper has changed Canada by far is in the area of federal provincial relations. The federal government now has the smallest fiscal footprint since the days of John Diefenbaker, but we still have uh, a modern welfare state. And that's because even as Stephen Harper cut taxes and cut taxes and cut taxes and made the federal government smaller and smaller and smaller, the provinces raised taxes to fill that gap. So we've had this transfer of wealth from the federal government to the provinces. And that's exactly what he wanted because Stephen Harper also wanted calmer federal provincial relations. And his approach to that was to just leave the provinces alone, let them do the things that they do, let the federal government do the things that it does. And I don't think that will be very easily changed back. In fact, I don't think it can ever be changed back. And of course, there is the issue of trade. Uh, Stephen Harper has, as perhaps his most important legacy, the fact that more than 50 countries have signed trade agreements, or at least initialed them, uh, with Canada under his watch. He has made the country more outward looking, um, more focused on the Pacific um, rather than just the Atlantic. And I think that's um, a great place for a country to be in at this place in the 21st century. And I think that too will be part of his legacy.